for me it's been a dream always to bring our children to our stage uh, like Staudai Akbar most often the privileged children come and showcase their talents here and i'm so excited today that our children got the opportunity to come and perform here i always believed that how do you break barriers of inequality and for me uh, showcasing our children to come and do the uh, performance here is one way of breaking the barriers of inequality and i think uh, atmos has done a great job of bringing 400 children together on the stage is not an easy job i think they have done a wonderful job of bringing them together and making them to believe in themselves that they can perform to perfection really happy to be witnessing this marvelous fantastic amazing performance by our children here it's been such a phenomenal experience for us for the children i think it's not just about the performance today but the whole run up to it uh, we so happy we found artmos who have done such an amazing job with our children and i think it has been such a learning experience for our children through the process you know the rigorous practice sessions uh, the feedback they've been getting and the sheer enthusiasm and energy that uh, the children have displayed through it i think it has been like a life skills journey for them at makra jagruti we have always believed in creating new and unique platforms for our children for their learning and for their holistic development and makra raga has been one such amazing you know platform the one thing that has got reinforced from makra raga is that our children can do anything this project is something that came on my hands and i'm extremely extremely grateful for this the most memorable uh, event was definitely getting all the students together for the first ever uh, run through together because they didn't know what was happening at all they were just like okay this is my season i have to be a flower i have to be snow i have to be different elements so when it all came together they were so happy and every student and the inputs we got from each and every student was spectacular that is very 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 memorable to us I I have never been connected to any other production as much as this one. It was every day was a new journey, every day was a new challenge. Uh, there were language barriers and things like that, but we had to overcome everything and make sure they learned our language of dance. So, uh, it's very close to my heart. The Bala Mandira itself has a different feeling when we enter. That's uh the kids there are so warm and I don't know why I have bonded with them uh, you know like uh, I am like an elder sister to them I guess I they keep saying yeah, that they are they, they keep telling me akka akka and all there's always something to take back each day uh, each child is different there uh, there have been quite an emotional ride it it has got its own ups and downs the biggest take back for us being privileged and them not being so privileged is the selflessness that they have is the caring nature that they have it is okay to just laugh and go ahead with the day is something that we should be taking care of and we should be learning from them there are so many wonderful moments that i had through this journey of teaching the kids in every school community center bala mandira visited the children have this instinct to help so when i went with the costume bags even before i could park the vehicle and get the bags out they would run come carry those heavy bags which are almost twice their size and would not let me carry it which was so sweet and nice of them apart from the different visits that i had the seeing all of them come together in the run throughs interact with each other and enjoy the process more than you no know, worrying about the outcome which i think we often do is what was very wonderful for me and i think i had a, such an enriching experience working with these children and i walk away from this completely enthused inspired and joyous this has been a production very close to our hearts we have loved every aspect of this production a few years down the line if i have to pick a project that i really enjoyed and very close to my heart i think i'm going to be saying uh, makkala raga 2023 one group especially the boys from bala mandira uh, i worked with them personally in their space before and when they came to this space looking at all the other children they were slightly intimidated and they were not able to give in their best so I had a nice talk with them and then tried to find out what is it that was bothering them and finally the second time when they performed they were at their best and you know that transformation and that amount of confidence that they gained through this process is for me something that i'll take back uh, for a long time to come